Hello, I'm Shauna Burden, the founder of No Validation Needed. To find out more about me and my organization, visit NoValidationNeeded.com. Okay, as promised, I do have another vlog post for you all. And this one right here, I know a lot of people can relate to. Have you ever felt so tied down by the opinions of others? Almost to a point where you were afraid to move on your own? It's almost like you're paralyzed by fear because you're afraid of being criticized, you're afraid of being laughed at, you're afraid of failing in front of everybody, you're just scared. We all have been here or we've all been through this at some point in our lives. So let's talk a little deeper about this. Let's talk about people bondage. Okay, so let's get into it. Like a puppet on a string. That's what I think about when I think of people bondage. Because you're being tugged and pulled in every direction in your life. Keyword, your. Where you should go to school. Who you should marry. When you should get married. When you should start having kids. How many kids you should have. Uh, what career you should choose. Even down to how you should style or rock your hair. Someone has an opinion about every area of life, period. I want to give you the definition of bondage. Bondage is the state of being bound by or subjected to some external power or control. People bondage. Here's the thing. Some people honestly mean well. They do. They give good advice. They have decent opinions. If you, even if you don't necessarily ask them for they, their opinions, they kind of just give it to you anyway. Um, so some people honestly mean well. But this is why I stress the, important, the importance of having a relationship with God for yourself. Because... People give good advice all the time, but if you don't have wisdom and discernment for yourself, you could be taking good advice that's not good for you. Here's an example. Let's say I have a homegirl named Shirley, and I tell Shirley, you know what? I know you're focused on your career right now and all of this, but you need to get out and you need to start dating. You know, you haven't been on a date in almost a year. You, you need to get out, put yourself out there. Stop focusing so much on your career. Start focusing more on dating, getting, getting to know people, um, having fun because you're not getting any younger. So, you know, put yourself out there, date because you don't want to be alone for the rest of your life. You don't want to look back at your life and see that you focus so much on your career that you're alone for the rest of your life. That's pretty good advice, right? I mean, it's, it's decent advice. But here's the thing. Stacy probably know that right now, she's not supposed to put any energy or any of her effort or any time into dating right now. Because she knows that she's in a season where she just wants to work on her relationship with God and get herself together. So to her homegirls, it looks like she's just focused on her career and making power moves within her industry. But what they can't see is that behind closed doors, Stacy is working on a greater plan, that she's working on a relationship with God, that she's really getting herself together. And so what can happen is if Stacy tries to live up to the expectations of people and if she cares more about how she looks in the eyes of others and if she follows that good advice, Stacy could end up setting herself back when she was actually on the right path for her life. You cannot be more concerned with your image in the eyes of others than you are in being in alignment with God. If you know that God placed 
something on your heart. He gave you a vision for something. You would be really setting yourself backwards by taking good advice from people who don't even who can't even see the vision that you have in your head, who don't even know what issues you're struggling with and the reason why you're making certain choices. People bondage. I want to uh, read this quote, which is a, a really good one and it relates to this topic. Don't ever let negative and toxic people rent space in your head. Raise the rent and kick them out. You can't afford to be in bondage. You can't afford to miss your moment because you are more focused on how other people see you or perceive you. It's very important that you know peace and that you follow the peace of God. I don't care if you are a supervisor at McDonald's. If you have a peace about that uh, about that, and you know that that is where God, you know, have you for right now and you know that this is where you need to be why would you allow family or friends to come in and to make you feel otherwise why would you go against what you know is right it's called people bondage and it's very important that we get rid of the strings and that we stop being puppets to the opinions of other people I also want to leave you with this because this is going to be a very short blog post. I want to leave you with John 14 and 27 New Living Translation because I talked a lot about the peace of God. I am leaving you with a gift, peace of mind and heart. And the peace I give is a gift the world cannot give. So don't be troubled or afraid. I want to encourage you to get uh, loose from people bondage. It's good to take advice and it's good to have mentors and spiritual uh, counselors, you know, that you can go to. But ultimately, you have to have a relationship with God for yourself. Don't be afraid to go to him for yourself and follow the peace of God. You have to have peace about whatever decision you make or whatever road you decide to take. All right, so I'm going to wrap up this vlog post. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel. I may be posting a vlog every other month or however I feel led to do so. So just keep up with me. Also, keep up with me on my social media networks. Of course, I have a Twitter. My official Instagram post is No Validation Needed. And my official website is NoValidationNeeded.com. Until next time, God bless. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, tweet me at NonprofitNVN, and visit NoValidationNeeded.com.